Hello riders, it's Josh from CycleHunters.com. Got Matt here too. Today is going to be a very cool video because we've been waiting now for quite a while, probably since I think at least we were told September, October is when we were going to get these. So there's a company out of Europe called Just One Helmets. Just One Helmets is a major, major motorcycle helmet brand for most people who know them. It's a motocross, primarily motocross helmet manufacturer. But they are owned by a company called H&H &H Sports Protection who owns Torque. So we had gotten word that H or Just One was going to come out with a very, very cool special helmet for the road. And today is the day that we finally get to see it and hold it in our hands. So this is the unboxing it. None of us have seen this thing yet, so we cannot wait to check this thing out, believe me. So here we go. Well, the pictures we did see of it, man, this thing's going to be sweet. <laughs> yeah, to say the very least. I mean, right away we'll give you the little hint, though. It is a carbon fiber helmet. That just adds to the coolness factor. The coolness factor is definitely going to be very very huge because when you find out how much Wait, you got an umbrella here yeah uh, that's the uh they give us an umbrella Whoa. sweet this is going to be the, called the just one jgpr grand prix racing i would right. think that's what gpr stands for well you did mention uh to me and i didn't know they actually this is a big sponsor of the moto e Actually, yeah, you're right. You did, you did mention Jordy that. Torres, the current champion for the Moto E Championship, which is the electric bike series and the GP series, wears the GPR. And that helmet looks sweet. It does look that sweet. Helmet. Now, you know, he's got his own livery and stuff on well, there. But uh, yeah, obviously when you're sponsored, you can do whatever you yeah, want. Yeah, you get whatever you want. You got some <laughs> artists that's doing this. So <laughs> without further ado, this is boxed. Very, very oh, that's professionally. Nice. That is nice. Look at this. That is a nice helmet case. So that's you got not just a freaking bag. That's nice. That's yeah, it's really it nice. is not just a helmet bag. This is actually a case. The sides are they, they're pretty pretty rigid. I mean, you don't I mean, need anything you're super hard. A bag versus oh yeah, how about case. how this about is, this is nice. So <laughs> oh yeah, let's let's go ahead and let's see this. I like it just because of that. I know, right? Handy and dandy. And what's the price point on that? Well, we're going to get to that. I was going to say, because it looks like it's expensive. Well, let's put it this way. Most helmets that well-known brands that are around the world yeah. selling their helmets, you could easily pay 1000 bucks. Easily, yeah. I've seen them for $3,500. Depends on what it is. Yep, depends yeah. on who, who's making I've it. I've seen it for quite a bit. Wow, look at this. So they give you, wow. Nice for the smoke shield. That's a dark smoke shield. So if you're if you're out on the track, you're gonna have uh, the ability, and it's got the little locking mechanism in here. It's got little screws on that. You can get right up candy. into there. <laughs> on the locking mechanism, looks pretty pretty stout. It's got the pin locks on the inside and here. And it comes with a pin lock. Yeah, it comes with the pin locks. Got some. Little little uh, microfiber towel. Fiber to wipe off. Some sweet stickers. Yeah. For horsepower. Yeah, it's always it's always gonna add like one or two. At least. That's probably like seven horsepower right there. The whole seven and a half. That's a whole bag of performance. That's that's what that is. Yeah, that is nice. Well, I'll tell you, and I mean, check that out. Yeah. That's all screwed in there. It's not just like it's some little piece that's on Ready there. For two hundred miles an hour. And they actually give you. Uh, <laughs> They actually give you some little Allen Allen keys here. Oh, nice. You have your... Uh, it's probably to make adjustments on the right. actual locking mechanisms on it. I know they always come loose on mm -hmm. other brands. That's cool to give you that. Italian design. Oh, Ooh. man. So, let's go here. Ooh. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Like, Just it's feel like that. air? It is really like air. Yeah, there's nothing there. The bag's probably the, probably the weight. the same, yeah. <laughs> All right, so let's check this out real quick. Look inside the bag here. You have like a little little spot for stuff, probably like cleaning supplies. Yeah. Cleaning supplies, yeah. But again. It's vented so it doesn't get all stinky. Yeah, how about? Get some air to flow through yeah. there. That's nice. That's good stuff. That's a, I'm sold on the bag. I'm telling you, man. <laughs> this thing is. I can't wait to do a performance video. So embroidered 
on the helmet. Just one, the art of racing. So you can go into your favorite browser and just type in just one helmets. And it's going to take you right to their website. But these are the first ones that we've gotten. So this is going to be the all carbon gloss. And with that, boy, they really like to make sure that these are protected, you know? Absolutely. Wow. And I'll be honest, the Torque helmets, they bring them like this too. So they, these guys, Packaged well. they do, H&H, &H, awesome. mm -hmm. they do a great job. Don't want to tear that. Drum roll. Ta-da! Oh, look, looky look. Oh, that's nice. Oh, my goodness. Oh, that weave is sweet. Wow. Oh, wow. Wow, wow, That wow. is a nice helmet. I cannot believe for the price. Yeah, well, we're going to get to that. Well, so you see, wow. this also has the little fin, the arrow fin on the back. This is ECE 2205 rated nice. right here. 50 countries yep. uh, is, you know, that's about what uses the ECE rating. DOT and that's, uh, Sneller. That's standard, yeah, yeah they're, they're the standard. Now you can see right away, this has the emergency pools down here. Nice. It even says it down here, the pool. Boy, it, it's a little carbon fiber bits right there. Oh, yeah. Just the profile of this helmet. You know, all the modern helmets are going to this wide front, this, this, you know, when you're canned forward like this so that you get your eyes up because it's designed for road racing. I mean, let's face it. It's a sport bike style road race helmet. I see plenty of vent. Yeah, right. Going on. You got venting here, here, up the top. So Boy, that's real nice and easy to slide back and forth. There's not a whole lot of fumbling with that. Plenty of venting. Your brow vents, mm -hmm. same thing. Real easy stuff. It's quality. You can feel the difference. See the latch mechanism looks pretty stout in there. Mm-hmm, and the cam system. Yeah, and it and looks like it's going to be easy to swap a shield out, actually, too. It doesn't look like it's... So the lock right here, you press your little button in and you push up. So it actually holds it. It holds it in place. So if oh, you're... So it looks like it also has a nice first stop for extra vent. Yeah, you can just sort of... Pop it out of the lock and then get your... If you need more ventilation. Yeah, so in the cam here, you're just going to pop that. Pop out the shield, both sides, you're going to do the same thing. Put it back in, snap it in, close it up, and it's going to lock it. You press that and push it up, you're good to go. But again, when you're leaning it's forward. It's like a seatbelt latch. Kind of. It really is, because that's, that's metal and right. You know that clips in there. Right, they screwed that on there, yeah. so that's, that's actually a really nice piece. And then, yeah, if you look at the side, it does have little Allen heads, so that's what those wrenches are for. Yep, that and the, and the back. Here. Yep. Just to keep everything secure. Nice. It even gives I'm you the going little. They have a little forethought. You know, they, they know you're going to have to keep this stuff tension and keep this stuff tight. I'm oh, yeah. Being a mechanic, I kind of like that to get a toolkit <laughs> with, your, with your helmet. As you know as well as I do, this is probably a size you're never going to be able to find in your toolbox. And they just all, they just give they it just to give you. They just give it so to you. That's, <laughs> that to me, it's the little things. It one, really is. one nice little thing here, too. This is rubber that goes around to seal that. Yeah, so that's going to really block that window. Yep, that's going to block that. You I have bet you your, if you close these vents up, I bet you'll be fine when we take this for a ride. It'll probably be pretty quiet. I, I don't doubt it. And I can't wait till we do that as well. Little uh, breath guard here, which that, that I'm sure is removable. Yeah, most of them are. And, and just about anything as far as these liners, uh, they're removable as well, which I'm... Let's see here. Yeah, the, this has the, uh, the button on it, so, you know, when you, uh, you do your D-ring here, you're just going to pop the button onto the side of your, your chin so that it's not flapping around and marking anything up or doing anything. Right there's your button. So when you go through your D-ring, you pop them in and then cinch it up and just put that there. That's pretty standard. But I don't know if you can see that there's like sort of a quilting almost inside of the the liner here. And these liners are all designed to come out so that you can wash them. Yeah, and it's so it's got the same like antifungal oh yeah, liner in it. So it'll keep it it won't be as stinky. 
the right, Pro TX2 good. liner. Intelligent fabrics. There you go. It's they telling you that you're sweaty. You. That's right. You're working hard. So let's see here. What size? This is a, this is a double XL. Well, how does well, it fit your Kanag? And well, I'm going to have to try it here, but uh, we'll see. Say in normal helmets, I'm between a large and an extra large. About the same. So are they Italian sized? I know everything. <laughs> Italy, China. I'd probably go things. one size smaller, but, yeah. but you know, these helmets are made to be tight to begin with. Yeah. Yeah, fitment. Pretty good. I mean, you can feel that it snugs around your head mm. and it hugs around right in here. It literally just pops on like that. So, I mean, it feels really great. No, no doubt. Just so Josh, what we all want to know, what is the price? What is the price of this helmet? <laughs> well, to do hey, as an infomercial, let me get would it. you pay eight? How much would you pay? <laughs> Again, you can see this is really good woven carbon. It's pretty much the first thing that Matt had seen. Yeah, I like to leave on that. For the retail price on these helmets, you can get yours for four ninety nine. That's insane. When you told me <laughs> right? when you told me the price on that for that's insane. Now, at CycleHunters.com, we really pride ourselves on finding the best stuff that we can for the best prices. Torque, I, I, I mean, we've been torque dealers for years and every year. And eventually I'm going to do a video on, you know, some of the different helmets through the years that they've had. But these guys are constantly evolving and revolutionizing their products. So they are not calm at, at all resting on their laurels with anything. I mean, all the way back to the T10s to now we have the T15s, which this in some sort of an instance kind of gives you a little bit of that look too, because again... All these helmets today, they're getting thin through the center. The uh, Your field of vision is getting a it's, lot broader. It's, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. It's much wider so that when you're leaning forward, you know, you're not just looking at the top of your helmet. You actually can see now in front of you a whole lot better than what you could before. So, look, and if you're an artist and have stickers, this is a great platform for all that stuff right away. So, absolutely. check it out. $4.99. That's, you that's can't beat perfect. that. No way. And again, the quality of it. I mean, you feel this. Yeah, that's that's a really, all really good fibers price. With the case. It, all, even, even the helmet itself. I mean, the fact that this stuff screwed on. If you if you do end up chipping this or whatever, I bet you you could probably replace. I don't doubt it. it. And actually, I think when I went to their website, so they did have replacement parts and things. So it's a, it, you know when you have a product like that and you're supporting it as well, you know that it's quality. Oh yeah, and again, That's Jordy not, Torres. That weighs nothing. I mean, this is <laughs> this is a. I mean, this is a guy that's been riding World Superbike for years. GP. Uh, yeah, he did do a stint in MotoGP, I think, and then um, Moto E is the champion. You can look at the countless riders that just won sponsors uh, for their motocross. So again, this is an Italian company that's been around a long time. They're very well known. They make awesome looking stuff. But as far as now getting into the road race game, I mean, this is a real big showstopper in my opinion. I really like it. I like carbon fiber stuff, though. <laughs> I do. Yeah, I, don't, I don't know why you wouldn't. I, I, I know, agree. I this is awesome. Italian chrome, right? That's, <laughs> Pretty that's much. what we got there. I, yep. But that is, that is really nice. The Italians, they do know how to do that. There's I no doubt. I will give that to them. They it's in the blood. Chrome. It is in the blood, for sure. So we say, Bella. <laughs> So listen, Sweet helmet. how about give us some comments? Tell us what you think. What is your favorite brand of helmet? What do you have? What do you look for in a helmet? I mean, obviously the number one thing is gonna be safety. Yeah, and that's got, that's got all, all the certifications on it, so it's gonna be safe. Yeah, absolutely. It's, I mean, it's a track certified basic helmet for 500 bucks, 499. That's, yeah. Carbon fiber, super lightweight. Your neck's not gonna get tired. You're going to be able to pronounce super leggera. Oh, <laughs> oh, I think you're correct. If we, if we went Italian on it. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, this is going to be something you're going to be staring at for a while when we put these up on the shelves, but beautiful. I mean, even down to the little, the I, little, listen, I already know what my next helmet's going to be. Me too. That's nice. Me too. You know what though? You know what though? Yeah, you're right. You're right. We got, we all love this helmet, but there is one. We do need an approval. We do need an approval. 
So we got to get him out here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come on. This is the new JP, uh, JGPR. Wow. Carbon fiber. How about, wow. wow. Feel this. Yeah. It's lighter than a pack of cigarettes. Four ninety nine. Is that all? <laughs> Does it have a visor inside too? No, this is a oh, race helmet. This one? Yeah. I like that. It's like a seat belt. See yeah. See, see, that's that's priceless too, that little edge that you have to be open there. My helmet presently doesn't do that, and I wish it did. So the question then is, yes, sir. is it Joel approved? Is it Joel approved? I like it. I like he it. He likes it. I'll give you an approval. Mikey likes it. Joel likes it. When it's Joel approved, we know it's good stuff. And he hates everything. <laughs> <laughs> Try to behave yourself. So guys, like and subscribe. We're really excited to bring this to you. We're going to have some more content with some of the helmets and things just to show you some uh, some different models and you know the evolution of these products through the years and what we've always thought is a great offering to our customers. And again, price is always a big thing, but the number one factor is safety. And everything that we've been looking through and getting these past, I don't know, since we've been getting this stuff, it's always been focused on that. And that price point is always a big part of it. So... Four ninety nine for a J, <laughs> just one. It could be yours for four ninety nine so payments, but four ninety nine. I mean, four ninety nine in the world of helmets. That's that's a bargain. So yeah, come down, guys. Check them out. Put them on. Put them through their paces. Cyclehunters.com, guys. This this helmet is is really nice. It's a really nice helmet, and we've been waiting forever. Yes. And it was worth the wait. Honestly. Yes. So that we'd is, like, we definitely like to say thanks to the guys in uh h and h for making sure that we got these things as fast as you could get it to us and uh we are definitely definitely pleased to say the very least so great job we'll see you in the next video happy riding that's joel approved